I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make a fake video call using your Android phone. But there's one thing you're going to need. You need a laptop. You can make use of any laptop of your choice. You can make use of a Core i5, of a Core i3, of a Core i2. Oh, sorry. There's not a quiet, you can make use of a core i7, but right here, you can make use of a core i5 V Pro Dell laptop. So now you understand the laptop I'm using. Let me explain the full tutorial to you. Now, you have to get your Android phone. Any phone can work for this tutorial. So when you get your Android phone, okay, you just open up your Play Store, then you you understand i'll show you guys everything from the beginning to the end so i'm going to click on clear data and i'm going to click on delete and now i'm going to go back to my amigo ai and show you guys what you should do so the app is loading up and by the way if you are enjoying this video subscribe comment where you are watching from i know i have a lot of viewers from ukraine and all over the world so wherever you are watching this video from comment and let me know it's you so i'm going to wait for amigo ai to load up now amigo ai has loaded up you can see the beautiful interface now this is running natively on my samsung s25 ultra so you can do this on any phone even the most stupid phone in the world can work with this so once the amigo ai has opened up you're just going to click on this sign in with google so your google accounts are going to take some time to load up but they are definitely going to show up on your screen so you can see my email address here i'm just going to click on my email address and i'm going to wait for it to sign in so it's going to take a couple of minutes and it's going to definitely sign in. Now, the difference here is now we have full premium access to this software. So we don't have to pay or wait like the previous video I made. I know a lot of you guys need the full tutorial, so you have to watch it to the end. So now it has read up. You can see it's telling me to choose my username. I can type anything. You understand? Then click on next. So then I'm going to click on this get started button over here. So when you click on get started, you're going to click on while using app, then while using app. So you can see me with my 17 Pro Max on the screen. So click on my you see the full interface. You can see that I'm on their pro plan. And you can see that this video was fully sponsored by Amigo AI. So once that's ready, you're going to see about four important buttons. But the most important one to us is this button over here. So if I click on this button over here, I can select any face and I can upload any face I want to upload. This is done real time on my Android phone. As like I said, you can use the most stupid laptop and the most stupid phone for this tutorial. So let me give you guys a demo. Okay, I'm going to choose one of these faces. I'm going to show you guys how it looks right now. So I've seen a picture I want to use and it's this particular picture. So what I'm going to do now is that I'm going to choose the picture and I'm going to point it at a face subject so you guys can see an example. And I'm not going to do it inside. I'm going to do it outside so you guys can get a full view of what Amigo AI is doing. I think they are the leaders of this game because there's nobody that is coming close. Even Avatar Five. So this is a very funny uh, time here. We have the same subject we used before for the, you know, the intro. So let me point it at this face and let's see what Amigo AI is doing. Can you see that job? Ah, uh, bro, can you see yourself on camera right now? Wait, this is crazy. I don't know how people are watching this video right now, but guys, this is insane. I think this is good enough to be used for video calls and pranking. Uh, what do you think? Let's resume the tutorial. But wait, I know that a lot of you guys want to use, you know, separate pictures, apart from the pictures that are on the app. In order to use separate pictures, okay, you can save them from your WhatsApp or whatever. So I'm just going to click on these three buttons and I'm going to click on save. So once I click on save, I'm going to go back to Amigo AI, okay? I'm going to click on this, you can see. Then I'm going to click on plus. Then I'm going to select the picture and it's going to start loading. So I'm going to wait for it to load up. All right, so it has loaded up and the picture now is showing on the screen. I'm going to show you guys outside so you guys can get a better view of, you know, how it resembles this picture now. This is the demo again, one last time. And this time I'm going to switch to the back camera. So to switch to the back camera, I'm going to click on here. Okay, and that's the back camera. And hope you guys can see. Um, we're testing a different picture now. I'm gonna move it slowly up so you can see him. You can see. So let me go closer so you can see the face. Um, open your mouth. And um, <laughs> what do you guys think? Is this software making the moves? Is this making sense to you? So put it in the comment section. Let's finish up the tutorial. All right. So to finish up, you're just gonna open your Play Store. Then you're gonna search for this app. The name of the app is called Do One. This is Do One. This is the application here. Now, mind you, the one did not sponsor this video. So, I'm just going to open up the one. So, when I open it up, first thing you're going to see is these two options. Do you want to connect to your PC wired that's using a cable, or do you want to connect wirelessly? So, I'm going to use the wireless method, you understand? So, let's finish up this tutorial. So, before we finish the tutorial, you must always have a middleman phone, you understand? So, for the connection here, this is the phone that is the middleman phone. And let's just say, it's a funny name. The name of the hotspot is I know Get Data. So, this is the hotspot. We are going to connect to on the laptop now on the laptop here <clears throat> we are just going to go to this section over here as you can see so 
we're going to click on it and we're going to switch from this iphone one to i know get data we're going to see connect automatically and it should connect so now that we have connected the hotspots what we're going to do is this remember that we downloaded the one on our android phone so we're going to go to the laptop and i'm going to open up our chrome browser so i'm going to double click on our chrome browser okay and once i load it up we're going to zoom in and we're going to search for the one so i'm going to type the one and i'm going to click on the one download you can see the one here i'm going to click on the download so when i click on the one download you can see over here so i'm just going to come and click on this the one here so once I click on it, you can see it's loading up. So I'm going to wait for it to load up. So once it has loaded up like this, you understand? You're just going to come and you're going to scroll down a bit. So you're going to see three versions. You're going to see the clear version, the Windows 64 bit, and the ETC sharp. So zooming in with the 4X camera, you're going to see this Windows 64 bit. So you're going to click on it to download it. So I've already downloaded it, so there's no need to download it. I'm going to show you guys the next thing you have to download. So the next thing we're going to download is OBS Studio. You guys can see OBS Studio here. We're going to click on this. So when you click on it, you're going to see something like this, okay? Then you're going to come and you're going to click on download OBS Studio. So once you click on download OBS Studio, you're going to wait for it to load up again. So I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to see download installer. Remember, it's download installer. I have already downloaded it already. So there's no need for me to download it. I'm only going to show you guys how to install it on your PC. This is just the button you're going to click to download the installer. So this is the file over here. And if I zoom in, you're going to see everything I downloaded. I downloaded OBS Studio and I downloaded the Do One setup. Now, in order to install Do One, you're going to double click on it. So when you double click on Do One, it's going to ask you this question. Then you're going to click on Yes. So once you click on Yes, you're going to click on Next. You're going to click on I Accept. Then you're going to click on Next. Then you're going to click on Install. So it's going to start installing on your PC. Just give it some time to install. Once that's finished, we are going to run the one. Click on finish and automatically it's going to run the do one app. So I'm just going to give it some time to load up. You understand? And by the way, if you're enjoying this video, it's not easy. Subscribe. You understand? See all the stress I'm going through for you guys. And if you're not subscribed, I don't know what you're doing. So automatically you can see by zooming, the one is already running. So once I open up the one, you're going to see a lot of things. Now, <clears throat> It's already telling you what you should do. It says you should open your phone that the same network is connected to. So this is the phone that the same network is connected to. Let me show you guys. So zooming out, you can see the phone, my S25 Ultra. So I'm just going to swipe up over here. Let me minimize this Telegram notification. Then let me focus well so you guys can see what I'm seeing. So this is the one. I'm going to click on the one. Then, you know, I'm going to click on stop mirroring because I was mirroring it before. So you can see it's showing three IP addresses. So I'm going to click on the first one. Then it's going to show me this. Then I'm going to click on share entire screen. I'm going to click on share screen. So you guys can see what I am seeing. It has been mirrored to my PC. If I zoom in on my PC, anything I'm doing on my phone is showing. Now, as I said, this phone is not really a phone, but I want to still show you guys the ability of Amigo AI and what it can do. You understand its potential. So now my screen is showing. There's a watermark on this door one. You guys can see the watermark. So I'm going to show you guys how to eliminate the watermark. You understand? So first of all, you're going to click on this button over here. Then you're going to click on do one. Still be watching. You can see I'm, anything I'm doing on my phone is showing on my laptop. So you can see. So I'm just going to open up my OBS Studio. Now, before we open up OBS Studio, you have to open your file explorer. Then you have to install OBS Studio first. So double clicking on it, it's going to show you this. Then you're just going to come and click on yes. So after I click on yes, I'm going to click on next, next, install. So I'm going to wait for it to install. Also, make sure that your phone screen is on. If your screen goes off at any time, then the whole thing is, you know, scattered. All right, guys. So you guys can see it has installed. And now I'm going to show you guys how to link it to your OBS Studio because that's the most important part. That's how you can use the Android for video call. So I'm going to click on finish. So when I click on finish, it's going to start loading up. Remember, this is not a gaming laptop. This is like, this is a normal laptop. It's not bad, you understand, but it's not up to the gaming standard. So I'm going to wait for it to load up. All right, so it has loaded up. And if you look at the interface, it's not that bad, you understand? So first of all, I'm going to click on this Remind Me Later button. Let me zoom in so you can get a better view. So over here, you're going to see something like this. I'm just going to say, I'm only using it for a virtual camera. Then you're going to click on Next. Let me go closer. Then you're going to click on Apply Settings. So once you click on apply settings, this is how it is going to look. So I'm just going to come here, okay? And I'm going to click on this plus under the sources. And I'm going to click on video capture. Don't click on window capture. Click on video capture. Then you're going to click on OK. Then you're going to come. Make sure your screen on your Android is on. You're going to come and you're going to click on device. Then you're going to click on the one camera. Wow, you can see. <clears throat> Let me zoom out. If I take my phone, 
let's see what happens even if you move your screen nothing is going to happen so the important thing you have to do here is that you have to come over here then move your mouse to the one then come to the, the one itself and enable this okay you come here you click on this then you click on the one camera so when i did that okay i don't know if it's going to work now let's see if i swipe you can see it's working now right so we found the solution we found a way to make it work without paying for anything so guys this video is not easy subscribe to the channel like you don't find this everywhere you don't find it every day so now we are done with that aspect let me just drop the phone here so i'm just going to come and i'm going to click on okay and now this is the important part so the scaling aspect so we're going to open up amigo ai and you can see everything is basically in real time so i'm going to shift this to the middle of the screen so that you guys would see everything well so i'm going to shift it to the middle of the screen and the picture i'm going to use is that same old man picture that you know we uploaded remember so i'm going to zoom in eight times i'm going to click on that picture so immediately i click on that picture now what i'm going to do is i'm going to go outside and um we're going to see how it looks in real time from outside to the laptop screen so that you guys can get you know a perspective of how everything plays out so that's what i'm going to do so guys you guys can see um the power of this software if i move you guys can see everything so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to do the scale it you understand so for you to scale it you're just going to come down okay you can see i'm coming down so i'm going to drag this then i'm going to put it in the middle like this you can still see the software trying to get in so i have to you know keep dragging keep dragging so i'm going to drag it again then i'm going to point it at his face and you guys can see i'm going to click outside then i'm just going to click on start virtual camera so now you guys can see so i'm just going to do this i'm going to open up telegram right now okay you guys can see for the first time this is on a dummy laptop i'm going to click on this button i'm going to click on settings okay i'm going to click on speaker and camera then i'm going to click on input device i'm going to say obs virtual camera can you guys see and you guys can see obs virtual camera again always make sure that this is enabled okay let me show you guys this is going to ask for this just click on x then you come here click on this red button this button over here then you click on the one camera so now if i come back to telegram see if i move my hand you can see everything is in real time now i notice something is wrong it's not positioned correctly so opening obs studio i'm going to drag it and drag it again so we kind of get it in the middle you guys can see now that it is working on telegram after the call you understand so the process now is you're going to open up amigo ai so this is amigo ai here okay so it may freeze on you so you're just going to come here and i'm going to select the picture again so we'll go front and we'll go back so let me show you guys again you can see the test subjects live put your phone down okay and i point it at his face can you see how clear it is you see it's showing the bushes and when i take it to his face immediately it shows his face as an old man as predicted <laughs> so guys if you enjoyed this video you guys don't forget to subscribe this video was very difficult i love people with me which i cannot even show but guys this video was difficult thank you guys for watching see you guys next time Want to start earning $1,000 a week online but stuck at account signups, failed exams, or verification roadblocks? Real freelancers don't wait. They start earning today. Want to start earning $1,000 per week online but stuck at account signups, failed exams, or verification roadblocks? White heavy check mark, we've got you covered. By verified freelance accounts, Telus, OneForma, Appen, Remo Tasks, Wellicalize, and more. Get exam answers that work and breeze through verifications, all done fast, securely, and anonymously. Globe showing Europe Africa trusted by over 500 freelancers worldwide. Ready to stop failing and start earning? White right pointing backhand index DM now. Spots are limited.